Video 7.3, Capitalization, First Words, Organizations, Religions, School Subjects. First Words. Capitalize the first words in every sentence. Capitalize the first word in a direct quotation when the quotation is a complete sentence. But don't capitalize the first word in an indirect quotation. For example, Miss Wise said, now we'll play Scott Joplin's Maple Leaf Rag. We're going to capitalize Miss Wise since she's a proper name. And we will also capitalize the word now since it's the first word in the direct quotation. Miss Wise said that the band would play. Since this is an indirect quotation, we are not going to capitalize the word that. It's an indirect quotation. If a quoted sentence is interrupted, begin the second part with a lowercase letter. For example, now, said Miss Wise, let's play Scott Joplin's music. We are not going to capitalize the word let's, since it's a continuation of the quote um, that starts with the word now, and it's been interrupted by said Miss Wise. More capitalization. Capitalize the names of languages, nationalities, peoples, races, and religions. Schools in Bhutan teach English as the official language. We're going to capitalize schools since it's the first word in the sentence, Bhutan since it's a country in Southeast Asia, and the word English is not just a class but a language, so that will be capitalized as well. The three Tibetan Buddhist monks are creating a sand painting. We're going to capitalize Tibetan, since it's a nationality, and Buddhist, since it's a religion. Monks are not specific enough to be capitalized, so that will stay lowercase. More capitalization. Capitalize the names of groups, teams, businesses, institutions, and organizations. Save the children. It's the name of a group or organization. New York Jets, the name of a team. Capitalize the names of school subjects that are followed by a number. Capitalize the names of all languages. Tara is taking Algebra 2, English, World History, and Journalism. Algebra 2 is followed by a number, so it's capitalized. English is a language, so it's capitalized. World History and Journalism are general subjects, so those will not be capitalized. Let's take a practice test on capitalization. Number one, do you know who said all's fair in love and war? In this sentence, we're going to capitalize the first word, do. We're going to capitalize the first word in the quotation, all's, and that is it. Number two, at Ohio State University, she majored in English and French. In this example, we capitalize Ohio State University since it's an institution. We capitalize English and we capitalize French since those are both languages. Number three, Patrick Henry said, it is natural for man to indulge in the illusions of hope. We're going to capitalize Patrick Henry, it's a proper name, and capitalize it, it's the first word of a direct quotation. Number four, the American League and National League baseball teams that train in Florida play each other in the Grapefruit League. In this example, we're going to capitalize American League, it's the name of an organization, National League, name of an organization. We won't capitalize baseball teams, that's not a specific organization or institution. We will capitalize Florida, it's the name of a state, and Grapefruit League, another name of an organization. That's it for this part of capitalization. Now try some on your own. Good luck.